hello guys you are welcome back to prospect channel tv thank you very much for this coming out here may god bless you all the executive governor of river state yes son wiki has come out to deny the media report that he has filed a suit against the people's democratic party presidential candidate atiku abubaka it will be recorded that the report, which went viral on Friday, has been attracting mixed reactions from Nigerians. Speaking at the commissioning of House of Assembly quarters in Port Harcourt on Friday, the River State Governor stated that he, is, he has nothing to do with the report. According to him, the people that are responsible for the misinformation about him only want to spoil his image. According to Chinese TV, Nwike said he knows that the report is coming from the article Abubakar's group. According to him, nobody should mention hide name if they lose the election. If they lose the election, nobody should call my name. I have told the candidate, he said. He said if he wanted to file a suit, he would have done that long time ago. And this have got everybody talking. Wike, you are lo losing sympathy from your fans. And, okay, too much of everything turns to evil. PDP made you great and we make you greater. There is wisdom in listening. Wike has already lost every many fans. Those that are setting him up by supporting his, his headlines and uh, whatever is and posturing do not understand the dynamics of Nigerian politics. APC would have defeated PDP without stress if Mwike had emerged as the presidential candidate and as a vice as a vice president candidate. The North, the South, the East, and some South South states would have cast protest votes if Mwike had chosen. Atiku saw all this and acted like an experienced politician. Mwike has a lot of fans minding to succeed in our nation elective office. He seemingly impressive performance during the presidential primaries would have disappeared in the main national election. PDP has already hurt Mwike now. If 14 out of 17 committee members supported Mwike as vice president, why turn your back on Mwike and when and he went and picked Governor Okora, who did not even stand election? Mwike is human being, even when Tabowe had to wink his vote on article or to make sure Mwike does not succeed. What is Mwike offense in PDP? Mwike stood by the party when article left for APC and later returned as a, as a political man and was less consigned in the party's affairs during trials period. PDP has really hurt Governor Mwike. It is the prerogative of Artiku to choose anybody and choosing Okawa, period. But Mwike said he has no interest in becoming vice president. They have already lost now. We are going to win with all, with or without Mwike. Everywhere you are, Artiku is the answer. <laughs> Surely they will lose woefully. Before call. Mwike, I am really disappointed in you. You are you are not a real politician. You are a bad loser. Your party had a free and fair primary election. You lost. Why can't you accept defeat? It's simple. Shows you are not yet fit for the presidency. Wait for your time. Your attitude now is simply disgusting. You better grow, please, and stop being childish. Hmm. Did I hear you say PDP had a free and fair primary? 
what Taboe did at the last minute was was what? Is that fair? This one did not even know what they are talking about. Okay, this man is ignorant and it's too much. Well, I don't blame him. In the country of the blind, now someone with half eye, not even one, is the king. Mwike is too much. He have got a hot temper. He got a hot temper. He cannot run Nigeria. Bwari that has a cool temper, he is ruling Nigeria well. We respect you, but no spirit of leadership in your heart. What of Osibanjo, what of Ameji and others in APC? Go to the APC, you will be a disgrace. Yoruba does not accept all nonsense you are performing for article. If God says article will enter, God can do it. You are not God. People are just mis misinterpreting the old story. Mwike is not aggrieved though. Because of the up- outcome of the PDP presidential election, it seems that Nigerians do not understand what is going on. He is not angry because of Atiku and his group betrayed his trust and lied against him. That is just why he is just angry because Atiku and his group betrayed his trust and they lied against him. You understand? His own here is that. Atiku lied against him. That is his grievances. That is his grievances. In the first place, I, I, think, I, 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 didn't, I didn't even see any reason why Atiku uh, Wike should be angry. Because he said he cannot accept any second class. Whatever. He's not a second class citizen. So, Wike needs to tell Nigerians the re- the real reason why he's angry. You understand? The real reason why he's angry. Some persons are saying here that articles do not supposed to emerge as a PDP presidential flag bearer because the the president is supposed to return to the south. Okay? I think that is a that is a point too. If that is the reason why at a uh, Mwike is hungry. Don't you think that is the, the, the anger is justified? Well, let's see how it goes. I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you very much for stopping by. Bye for now.